Hi, Martin. Hi, Eddie. Look, I'm sorry that this is such short notice, but can you get to an audition in Baker Street in the next hour? Uh, yes, of course. It's for a new TV police drama. I got the dates mixed up. I didn't realise it was today. The producer just phoned to see where you were. I'm really sorry. Hey, don't worry about it. This is great news. So what part is it? Uh, it takes place in a nightclub and you're the bad guy. Oh, and there's a fight scene. I think that's why they want you to audition. They saw on your CV that you did a lot of boxing at school. Uh, well, I exaggerated a bit. I only did it for a term. But hey, I'm an actor. I can fake it. Anyway, you'd better get going. I'll text you the address. Good luck. And let me know how it goes. Thanks, Martin. I'll call you when it's over. Bye. Bye. That's brilliant. Thank you. Take care. Bye. I'm really sorry that you've been kept waiting. I had no idea the other actor would be this late. I just spoke to his agent. He should be here soon. No need to apologise. It's not your fault. I'll just go over my lines again. Yeah. No, thank you. I've said no. Leave me alone. Sophie! Eddie! I didn't know you were auditioning for this. Nor did I till an hour ago. Hello, Eddie. Roger Evans, the producer. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't introduce you. I thought you knew each other for some reason. Oh, that's all right. Nice to meet you, Roger. I'm really sorry about all the mix-up. Oh, never mind. You're here now. Uh, here's the script, Eddie. Um, you're playing the part of Bob and you're in a nightclub and you've just come over to Sophie and you want her to dance and she doesn't want to. Oh, right. I'll fill in for the part of the nightclub bouncer and let's make it as realistic as possible. So, when you're ready... Hi, uh, do you want to dance? Uh, no thank you. Oh, come on, just one dance. Come on. I said no. Leave me alone, will you? I don't want to dance. Is this gentleman bothering you, miss? You stay out of this. <laughs> oh, Roger, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. Oh, here, let me help you up. Are you okay? I'm sorry. It's okay. I don't think anything's broken. Right. Should we try that again? Yeah. Hi, Mum. Oh, Eddie, I'm glad you phoned. I was just about to call you. Look, I'm really sorry. I'm afraid I forgot to collect your dry cleaning. I'll get it today. It doesn't matter, Mum. It's not urgent. Hey, guess what? I've just been to an audition for a new TV drama and... I got the part. Oh, that's fantastic news. Brilliant. Look, why don't you come round for a cup of coffee and tell me all about it? Yeah, great. Oh, and by the way... I'm sorry about last Saturday. I shouldn't have lost my temper. It wasn't your fault I couldn't find my wallet. I can't believe I shouted at you. Oh, forget about it. You were just upset. And I'm sorry for not being more sympathetic. No, don't worry. Right, I'll see you in about ten minutes then. OK, I'll put the coffee on. Bye. Bye, Mum. <laughs> 